In this video, we will learn to fix Far Cry 5 error msvcr100.dll is missing. So let's begin. Well, what you have to do is just go in the description and there will be a link to this page that is dll-files.com and here the heading says download msvcr100.dll. So just scroll down below. Once you have landed on this page, just scroll down below. And here first we have to f download the 32-bit and then the 64-bit file. And we have to keep care that we download the files of the same version. First we have to download the 32-bit file of this version. Just go and click on the download. And here the download will start in few seconds. So the download has started and will be finished. Now we have to download the 64 bit of the same version. So the version we had for 32 bit is this one. We would download the 64 bit of the same version. So just go and click on the download. And the download for 64 bit will start in few moments. So the download has started and is complete now. After that just go and check what kind of system you have. Is it 32 bit or is it 64 bit? For that just go to your desktop and here just go to your this PC, right click it and here click on properties. And again the system type you can see that I have 64 bit operating system and 64 base processor. So by doing so you would know what kind of system you have. Now just go and open your downloads folder and here we have both the files. First we would solve the system for 32 bit. Now just go and extract the 32-bit uh, DLL files. Once you have extracted that, just go and extract the 64-bit DLL files. Once you have extracted both, we would first solve the system for 32-bit. For that, just go and copy the 32-bit DLL file. Copy it. Once you have copied it, just go to your this PC. Here go to local disk C. Go to Windows. And here just scroll down below and search for system32. Search for system32. Here we have system32. Just go and open that. And here paste the file. Paste the 32-bit DLL file here. Paste it. And click on continue. So I have pasted the file here. Just go back. And now the problem for 32-bit system will be solved. Now we will solve the problem for 64-bit system. For that, first go and copy the 64-bit DLL file, copy it. And just go to your Windows folder. Here are you in Windows folder. And just open the System32. Again open the System32. Paste the 64-bit DLL file in System32. Paste it here. Continue. Go back. Now copy the 32-bit DLL file from here, copy it and again go to your Windows folder and here search for syswow64 and here we have syswow64 just go and open that and here paste the 32-bit DLL file just paste it here click on continue so the problem for 32-bit and 64-bit both have been solved if you still have any confusion for from where to copy, where to pay, just go back on the video and hope the problem will be solved. If you still have any confusion, just go and comment down below. I will try to answer that. But before you go, please subscribe, like and share. Thank you.